Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be looking at people reveal compliments they will always remember. So yeah, let's just get right into the video. When I was like 19, I had an ex who had a history of abuse. We were arguing about something, I can't remember what about, but we were both shouting at each other. Then suddenly she broke down crying and started hugging me. Very confused, I let the moment pass until she could speak and the compliment she paid me was, even when you're angry at me, I'm not scared of you. Oh. Wow. I guess that just made her drop the argument, eh? She was like, this could have been a lot worse with my ex. Wow. Someone once told me, it's so easy introducing you to people. You make everyone feel like you're their best friend. Have held onto that for over 10 years. Still helps to remember when I'm not at my best. Dude, those people are the best kind of people. They adapt so quickly. It's amazing. But then again, it's really hard to know how they really feel because they're just so happy with everyone. So yeah. One thing to look out for as well, you know, like the most charismatic people you gotta look out too. A lovely elderly lady stopped mid-sentence to say, you have got the kindest eyes. Aww, damn. <laughs> That's cute. You better believe that if an elderly lady told you that because they've lived life already and they don't need to lie about anything anymore. <laughs> Old people are just honest. They don't care anymore. So yeah. That was a true compliment. My dad once said, I don't say it enough, but I'm really proud of you. Which was the only time he ever said it, but it meant a lot. Wow. How many of us can't relate? <laughs> I mean, we know our dad loves us, but they never say it. And if your dad say it, well, lucky you. But you know, it'll be nice if they say it once in a while, but they just don't say it. Like they show you they love you through actions, but never verbally. Sometimes people just need to hear things verbally. Hmm. I was moving a pallet through the aisles at work one day years ago. I said, excuse me, as I walked by an older gentleman and he responded, I will never stop a working man. Not a compliment per se, but it brought a smile to my face and I remember it to this day. Oh, that's nice to know that they're respected. Very nice. Because some people, they just don't respect someone that's working. You know, like they think someone working is lower than them or something. I was in my early 20s and I went out on town with some girlfriends. I wore an outfit that was way out of my comfort zone. It was a black short skirt. I always wear pants that flared out with a matching top. It showed a bit of midriff and I was self-conscious. Before we even got to the bar, we ran into a couple of girls we didn't know outside. I remember the one girl did a double take and just started freaking out. She went on and on and told me how gorgeous I looked and how amazing my outfit was. She had obviously been drinking, but it didn't matter. She changed my whole night around and I suddenly felt like the hottest girl on the planet. <gasps> I still remember her voice when I'm trying to pump myself up in the morning. I love women who love women. Same. Dude, that's the best. Compliments from girls are honestly the best. Like they just feel so different. They just feel the best. You just know that there's no hidden meaning to it. They're complimenting you because they want to make you feel good. And it actually makes you feel like you deserve the compliment. My friend is a veterinarian and after spending a weekend with me and my dog, she said in my next life, I want to come back as Rex because he was so happy, so well taken of, so loved. She's an animal professor and saw my relationship with my dog and thought that was the best. I can't think of a higher compliment. Say, so, someone said this to me too. And yeah. <laughs> I felt good, okay. Yeah, you wanna be born as Coco again? Sure thing, I'll take care of ya. When you speak, it makes me think. Wait, is that a compliment? <laughs> mm, I guess it could mean that they're smart, right? But then it could also mean I never understand what you say, cause you're dumb. <laughs> the first time my then girlfriend, now my wife, saw me naked, her response was, wow, excellent. Wow. A friend told me that when we first met, he hated me because there's no way someone can be that nice and respectful without it being fake. What? What kind of people has he been meeting, man? Anyone nice is just fake to him? Dad. I guess one thing we can take away from this is just compliment people more because they will remember it. Well, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Tell me in the comments down below what your thoughts are. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked it and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.